Hello, welcome to Rise. My name is Bill. My handle is Raina. I am currently starting in the apartment as if I was just starting Rise for the very first time. If you follow my mouse, you can look out the windows. Each apartment in the Bradbury Towers has a slightly different view of the city. The only thing that you can realistically do in the apartment is save yourself from burning fuel by putting your character to bed when you log off. Let's get into my C2, my car, and start earning money so that we can get an airplane and or a spaceship to start. You move your mouse up to Intermedia, enter your vehicle. When you first get in the vehicle, you will notice it is black. It has no power running. That's because it shuts off. You press the P, and the engine turns on. And the lights kind of flicker a little bit, and things start to come to life. If you want to turn the driving lights on, things get much brighter. If you turn the overhead light on, you can tell that this is an older version C2. Most likely you have a newer one, which is actually nicer than the old C2s, but these old C2s are available if you find them on auction or abandoned, you might end up wanting to buy one. Right here is the navigation unit, and the other instruments are pretty much standard car instruments. Let's go to http colon whack whack rise dot dot com dios that will take you to the map page of the city and show you a bunch of the buildings that have anything that gives you a menu we currently want to go to the bank so you click down here on the unused waypoint under location and then you type in south 4.11 oh, I'm sorry that's the wrong number so I want south 4.199 South 4.199 and West 26.117, I do believe. That shows up as being 2.56 kilometers away. I want to save this waypoint. So I click on the words unused saved waypoint hit rename to rename it. It's easy to just click it with the mouse. And then you get rid of the old text. And I'm going to put this at the top of the list by typing one space B-A-N-K. And magically, it is now at the top of my list. I also want to create a waypoint to find my way back to the Bradbury apartments. So I click on the unused again. I click on the flag to mark, and it shows that I'm my waypoint's right here, and I rename that. I'm going to name that one home. Just because that makes sense to me. You can obviously name them whatever you want. Now, we want to go to the bank, so I click on bank, and then the activate icon you see the navigation device shows 2.056 kilometers away and almost straight behind me. Now I do not need the waypoints anymore so I can close them. If anybody else was on right now I would be looking for their typing up here. That's my health indicator and we don't need anything else. If I was driving with a keyboard I would be using the star and divide sign for the gear selector like that. 
I am using a joystick which uses buttons 3 and 4 for the same thing. The steering is obviously the yaw, and it's also the arrow keys, the, the four arrow keys. The accelerator is the up arrow, or the throttle if you have a joystick. Coasting is the down arrow, and the space bar on both of them is the brake. So let's start moving, but, but first I want to turn the overhead back off. So I'm going to start by putting it into third gear, and cracking up the, the throttle a little bit, and turn it to the right. Notice that Dios has roads, and they have curbs. Those curbs will kill you if you get going too fast and plow into them. So you want to le learn how to press Shift R, or you want to map a key on your joystick to. Shift R so that you can repair whenever you want. Do you need to follow the roads? No. Can you go anywhere on the planet? Yes. As long as you don't hit a building, um, a building or something solid. That's the best way to put it. In the city, you probably don't want to get much above 60 kilometers per hour because those curbs will kill you quite easily. I'm actually following the streets trying not to hit curbs this time because I missed the intersection. There we go. Okay. We're actually in the financial district now if you take a look at the intermedia. I think I found a dead end. Ah. Oh well. Let's avoid the building and head straight for that um, road over here. Ah.
if you were starting... Oh, somebody's parked here also. If you were starting for the first time, you would click Open Bank. Open Account on the Fleet Bank menu. I already have a bank, so it's telling me sorry. This ends opening the bank. You go to the next video, that'll talk about um, taxi driving and earning money.